In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to find your GoDaddy domain authorization code. This process is essential if you're planning to transfer your domain to another registrar, and we'll walk through it step by step, ensuring that you feel confident and comfortable with the process. First, you'll need to log into your GoDaddy account. This is the hub from which you'll manage all your domains and settings. If you're not already signed in, head over to the GoDaddy homepage and enter your login credentials. Once you're in, take a moment to familiarize yourself with the dashboard if this is your first time. It's always a good idea to make sure you're navigating from a secure and trusted internet connection to protect your account information. Next, we are going to locate your account manager. Here, you'll find a list of all the domains you own. If you have multiple domains, it might take a moment to locate the specific one you intend to transfer. Go ahead and click on that domain to open its settings page. Now, while you're in the domain settings, you'll need to look for the option that allows you to transfer the domain away from GoDaddy. This might be slightly tricky depending on the layout changes over time, but it's typically found under Additional Settings or something similar. Occasionally, it might appear alongside other options labeled as Transfer from another registrar with a mention of a specific date. Now, it's important to remember that GoDaddy has a policy whereby domains cannot be transferred within 60 days of certain activities. These include new domain registration, a transfer from another registrar, or changes to the registrant's details such as first or last name, organization, or email address. Ensure none of these restrictions apply to your domain. If the transfer option is available and you spot it, you'll then need to click on the link or button that says click here to see authorization code. This is a critical step. Upon clicking, your unique authorization code will be displayed on the screen. This code is your ticket to transferring your domain, so it's important to proceed carefully. Once you have the authorization code displayed, make sure to copy this code accurately. You don't want to accidentally copy an incorrect code as it could delay the transfer process. After copying it, store the code in a safe and accessible location. Many people choose to save it in a password manager for security. Remember, this code will be essential when you begin the process of transferring your domain to a new registrar. And there you have it. With these simple steps, you've successfully retrieved your GoDaddy domain authorization code. Thank you for watching, and I hope this guide has been helpful. Stay tuned for more tutorials and tips.